nurses work the front lines in the U.S. healthcare system and are often the first point of care at a hospital or doctor's office. It can be an extremely rewarding career and nurses are consistently ranked as the most trusted profession each year. But on the other hand, it can be an expensive career path to pursue. According to a 2017 study by the American Association of Colleges of Nursing, 69% of graduate nursing students surveyed in 2016 took out federal student loans to finance their education, and the median amount of expected debt by graduate nursing students was $40,000 to $60,000. Depending on where you work, there might be county, state, or federal student debt forgiveness program options available to you. There might also be employer assistance you could qualify for as well. In this video, we will take a look at three federal loan forgiveness options to consider if you're a nurse looking for debt support. Option number one, Nurse Corps Loan Repayment. In exchange for working in a designated high-need area for two years, qualified applicants will have 60% of their total unpaid nursing education debt paid off through the program. If you continue working in a no qualified area for a third year, Nurse Corps will pay off another 25% of the loan's original balance. So you might ask, who's eligible for the Nurse Corps Loan Repayment Program? Well, according to the Nurse Corps Loan Repayment Program requirements, to qualify for loan repayment, you must meet the following criteria. One, you must work as a licensed registered nurse, advanced practice registered nurse, such as a nurse practitioner, or a nurse faculty member with qualifying nursing debt. Two, work full-time in an eligible critical shortage facility in a high-need area or an accredited school of nursing. Three, Receive your nursing education from an accredited school of nursing located within the U.S. An important note, even if you qualify, Nurse Corps gives out funding preference depending on financial need. Option number two, National Health Service Corps loan repayment. If you are working full-time in a health professional shortage area with a score of 14 to 26 for two years, you could be awarded up to $50,000 or up to $25,000 as a part-time worker. If you work full-time in an area with an HPSA score of 0 to 13 for two years, you could be awarded up to $30,000 or up to $15,000 as a part-time worker. This wider loan repayment option is not just for nurses, but also other qualified medical professionals. The amount of loan forgiveness you receive is primarily based on the community you work in and also the level of need. So you might ask, who's eligible for the NHSC loan repayment program? Unlike the Nurse Corps program, part-time or full-time nurses can be eligible for the NHSC loan repayment program. Besides working at HBSA area, you must meet the following criteria. One, be a U.S. citizen. Two, be a provider in the Medicare, Medicaid, and state health insurance program as appropriate. Number three, be fully trained and licensed to practice in the NHSC eligible primary care medical, dental, or behavioral health discipline in the state in which you are applying to serve. And number four, be a health professional and eligible discipline with qualified student loan debt for the education that led you to your degree. Option number three, public student loan forgiveness. The PSLF program was introduced in 2007 and was established to encourage individuals to enter and continue in full-time public service employment. While not specific to nursing, many in the field might find that they also qualify for loan forgiveness through this program. So you might ask, who's eligible for the PSLF program? Borrowers eligible for the PSLF need to make 120 qualifying payments while working full-time for a qualifying employer. Only federal direct loans are eligible for PSLF. The federal student aid website includes complete descriptions of what a qualified payment, qualified employer, and full-time employment means for PSLF applicants. However, the only way to be positive that you qualify for PSLF now or in the future is to complete and submit the employment certification form as soon as possible. According to the Federal Student Aid website, too many borrowers wait to submit this important form until they have been in repayment for several years, at which point they learn that they have not been making qualifying payments. If you would have further questions or would like more information on the debt forgiveness options available to you as a healthcare worker, visit wealthnest.com forward slash nursing. And as always, thanks for watching.